Hey everybody, thank you for tuning in. Uh, I'm Brian and this is the High Wire Jam. It is a small but dedicated and excited group. Um, this is the cookout you should be at. You're at that, you're at that one where you know it looks like it's really nice. It looks like it's really nice, but you know, everything is store bought. No one made anything. There's like a big they they didn't even take the the uh potato salad out of the store container and put it in their own they just brought it um yeah and it's uh, it's it's not where you want to be so we are super excited to be jamming with you uh we are going to do a montage um and i am getting ready to find my spam folder for the traditional word of the day for our uh, <laughs> our uh um our show and the first word that I saw was toothbrush. <laughs> so our suggestion is toothbrush and we will be doing some improv for you now. Toothbrush. Uh, 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 Okay, okay. I, I, I admire your dedication to, to good hygiene, good dental hygiene, but I'm trying to sleep. Mm. We have a bathroom. I don't understand why you come in and do this over my bed. I love you, honey. That's why. Well, I, I love you. I love you too. I, I do. And again, you know, but this, like, doing everything right on top. Oh, wow. You are really going at it. Mm. Mm. Oh, okay. It's, now it's, All right, okay, it's okay. Getting in my eye. I'm done. And now we're flossing. Okay. Um, is there another reason that why was, you're in here in the middle was, of the night? Sweet mouth, so I can kiss you. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. That that was sweet. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for the kiss. All right. But you know, I have to get up early tomorrow. I have a very big presentation, and I just feel like maybe there's another reason why you're in our room brushing your teeth over top of me loudly. There is, there is. I wanted to show off my new toothbrush. Oh, it's wonderful. I, I got but that. You know what's you. special about it? It's a Bluetooth toothbrush. You're very excited about it. Uh, I am. It is connected to my phone. Mm -hmm. And it counts how many, it counts the minutes because as you know, I actually. 30 seconds, I shy, and 30 seconds, I shy, and 30 seconds, and I shy, and I get a Tag out, tag, tag out both of you and bring in Michelle. <laughs> um, okay, I, I just thought my first CIA assignment would be more <laughs> than hacking into Bluetooth toothbrush. I, how is this going to help <laughs> us? Oh, yeah. You know. Yeah, okay, so you know, Matt. I mean, I, I'm coming to you because I really trust you as our number one spy to really right. crack the code, the clicking, right? It's the clicking of the toothbrush. That's okay. what you have to this listen is, for. You're, you're, this, this dossier is for an elementary school principal in Temecula, California. <laughs> how, how is knowing their toothbrushing clicking numbers how that i just don't get it <laughs> tag out michelle i don't know how you got to be the number one spy you asked so many questions just take your assignment and do it i have tried no. well I have been why can't i shadow for years i'm over this Matt. why can't i ask questions why can't i ask questions that's just that just seems like it's part of spying is learning things it's to do the assignment that is look go and do the assignment don't question why we are okay. on a need to know basis you got the no and you don't need to, oh i can't believe you got okay. the promotion okay. over me 
I, I, I know it was, but I just don't understand why I am tracking the Bluetooth refrigerator of a junior CPA in Lincoln, Nebraska. It doesn't make any sense. Check out Brian and Millie and bring back Casey. <laughs> did you get, did you get the message? <laughs> ah, that message. That that was in the in the yogurt, <laughs> the message yeah. in the yogurt in the Bluetooth refrigerator. It said, "Cyber attack at dawn." Okay, note taken, Sheila. Oh, all right, Svetlana. Okay. What we what what next plan? We report to Putin. We have to report to Putin, of course. Putin is our leader. I must cross myself whenever I say Putin. Yes, yes, yes. He is watching us as we speak, so. <laughs> so noon, noon is the time. Noon uh, Moscow time or, or noon Greenwich Mean time or noon oh. Eastern time? <laughs> oh, did you not get that message? Did you not get it? It just, said, it just said noon and the yogurt. Oh, that's the done, yeah. Oh. That's yet, 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 abort, abort, abort. Okay. Take out, uh, take out both and bring in Millie. Well, the good news is they don't teach time zones in Russian school. <laughs> um, so we averted a serious attack. It was not through any of my sleuthing or skills. They just don't know how to do time zones. <laughs> Yeah, uh, I did read through your transcripts. It seems like yes. this is the case for you. They're just asking as many questions as you do. I mean, this is ridiculous. Hang out, Millie. Uh, so, Brian, I've never yes. seen you in this bar before. <laughs> no, no, I usually don't go to this one um, because they only have one clock here. I like those like uh, uh, newsroom style where they have like a clock of all the places around the world. I like to know what time it is everywhere at all times. <laughs> you are a very intelligent man. Yeah. So Brian, I hear I hear you're a man who likes to ask questions. Where did you hear that? <laughs> My toothbrush told me. <laughs> How does your toothbrush know that? It's not important. It's well, very highly advanced technology. Uh, but where did uh, you get where did you get this toothbrush? Well, you know, I thought asking questions would be sexy, but now that you're doing it, <laughs> it's kind of a turn off. <laughs> but tell me more about these these clocks. Is not same time around the world? No, no, that's not. All. Although, although, do you, are you familiar with time zones? Do you know what time <laughs> zones are? No, I am, do not know the time zones. Okay, tag out Brian and Casey and bring back Millie. Oh, okay. Dr. Smith, our spies, they are spiraling. This is, uh, this is not, uh, this is not good, good spying. This is not good spying. No, it's not. Uh, I, I really, I think we got off track when we gave them that uh, seminar on question everything. <laughs> yes, the was... question everything. I mean, we were doing what we were supposed to be doing. We were mm -hmm. supposed to introduce a critical outlook, sensitivity, listening skills, but now they, they can't take orders. No, they're going off book. They've gotten too stuck on time zones. I'm not even sure what that's about. I mean, I, I feel like we, we may have to um, scrap this program and just start with a whole new set of spies. I think so, Dr. Smith. Should we, should we just tell them or do you think we should just kind of let them be in the field indefinitely <laughs> hmm. well this is again this is not a time this is not a time for us to ask questions we must be decisive we must show them it, it is our last hope we, we we must cut them off but we Enough. must we must set a good example to do so 
Okay. Because I have a feeling mm -hmm. they're not going to get it. They're not going to get what's happening. So I, I, I think that's because the spy is being cut up, and now that they're cut off. So we're firing you. Net, net. You cannot fire me. Uh, I I just did. I, I, I I'm, I'm following my directives and being direct. Um, Lana. Oh, Sheila. We are fired. What is this? I got your message on the toothbrush. It said fire into the fire. Nope. Uh, we 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 don't need your services anymore. It's it's How not working out. You? How dare you fire me when it's three o'clock in the afternoon? Sheila, that is Sidebar. not Sidebar. the time. How, how, after Sheila, oh. don't you what? get it? She's one of those oh, right. double You're right. spies. She's You're right. She's she's a double agent. You're right. You're right. Okay. All right. Here's what we need to do. I'm wasn't very quiet. I could hear you. Not a double agent. I, I am. I was tasked with letting you know that you're no longer spies for our agency. So thank can, you we come back to, can we come back to Moscow now or what? Are we stuck here? In a side sidebar. Okay. She she is triple agent. I see. <laughs> yes, clearly. I, I think we need to take her out. We do. We need to take her out. I will have to give her. Okay. We Again. are taking you out to Applebee's. Yes. Come with us. It's That's... a good plan. You will like. Enjoy much Applebee's. Yes, yes. You must enjoy their appetizers or apps. Again. We will uh, meet you there at okay. 7 p.m. You know what? I... Sounds good. I'll see you at 7 p.m. <laughs> Sing. <laughs> or Pacific? <laughs> <laughs> yes, welcome, welcome. Uh, I have laid many toothbrushes out in front of you. I just want you to touch the one that speaks to you the most. I understand this is an unusual tarot reading, but let's just be open-minded. <laughs> yeah. Um... The toothbrushes okay. speak to me. I know, I know, I know. I'm just, I'm, I'm trying to feel the, feel the, the power. I got to go with the Buzz Lightyear one. I, I mm -hmm. just really feel like that's, that's, that's mm -hmm. me today. Okay. All right. Let me, let me feel on. Let me think. I let me connect with this one. Uh, all right. Uh, it's probably not the message you were expecting. I'm sure you were thinking about something about maximizing your goals and beyond to infinity and beyond something like that uh it it actually because you have chosen this one it means very soon you're going to be fired thank god i've been i've been i i've been intentionally screwing up like a lot and they're just they're just so nice they're so forgiving they just, I mean, I mean, yeah, I mean, I get it. They're the Catholic church and they kind of have to do that. But I've just been like, I've been like, I, I read a transcript of a confession as my homily two weeks ago. And they're all just like, just say you're sorry. And I'm like. Oh. Tag so cool. out Christy and bring in Casey. I don't know. Mm. Father O'Shea, mm -hmm. that homily was was not up to our expectations here at the convent complex. Yes, yes, uh, Father Brian, uh, here at the Church of Perpetual Motion, mm -hmm. we want something a little more up, uplifting that everyone can relate to. Your your confession to shoplifting lingerie is just not. Mm -hmm. It's, no. not a, it's not a very loving and Christian message. True, you true, but as we all know, we are all sinners, so you must forgive me. You 
know, that's, that's kind of a little old. That whole thing of like you must, we must forgive you. I mean, that's <laughs> that's a little enabling, don't you think? <laughs> Yeah, All right. also the forgiveness is kind of contingent upon your showing remorse and feeling truly sorry and we right. detect none of that. All right, I'm just going to level with you. Uh, um, I like having Sunday off. I really <laughs> like sleeping in. I really like sleeping in and I'm sorry no matter how much I try. I'm more of a mixed drink guy. I don't like wine. It's just, I mean, can we... It really can't we be a little flexible? It's been two thousand years. I we can say, here's the wine, here's what it is, it's all that jazz. But if you would like a Tom Collins, you can have a Tom Collins. <laughs> Tag out Michelle and Casey. So as your guide to hell, uh, it seems like you've gotten your wishes. You've got every yeah. Sunday off and yep. nothing but mixed drinks. Uh, you will no longer uh, have Saturdays. Every day is just Sunday. And oh. um, mm -hmm. so you're continually in the Sunday scaries. And, uh, you know, you got your Tom Collins, but you are not allowed to ask for water. So um, welcome. I see. I I, I was thinking I was going to get Tom Collins the drink, but there's actually a guy named Tom Collins who's following me around and just, just like poking me mm -hmm. with a stick, with the, yeah. the eternal we can, stick. We can get that uh, stick sharp and right up for you, no problem. Oh, no, I just, I just can't, yeah. can I? Maybe, oh, you want a hot poker? We can do that too. <laughs> oh, no, okay, but. <sighs> you prefer flailing. Uh, we can do that. I mean, is there any way to get fired from hell? I'm really good at getting fired from things. I really am. Jump to hell, HR. <laughs> okay, I, so, Brian. Yeah, uh, I, I started that charity drive. How'd you like that charity drive where we raise <laughs> money for less fortunate people? That was uh, Brian, uh, we have gotten some complaints that you are expecting this to be less hellish yep then just a little bit just than a little hell bit. and you are yeah. making uh demands that are not in your job description right i like see i was i was not aiming for heaven i was aiming for purgatory like i was <laughs> cool with with that i if you you're know you're an overachiever you're in hell oh gosh no one has ever called me an over I mean, I'm sitting here. I'm I'm Booberg from Purgatory. We kind of like his moves. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm in play. I'm a free agent here. Is that what's going on? Yeah. Oh, uh, okay. All right. Okay. All right, Purgatory. Yeah. What What have you got to offer Hell, though? If we let you have Brian, I nobody asked, but I just want to say, Heaven, we're we're good. You guys can work this out. <laughs> I, I, okay. I, I, Thank, thanks for letting us know. Okay. All right. What you got, Purgatory? Hit me with your best offer. Well, we got the managed fucking software center, excuse me. And uh, God knows it has a mind of its own. And uh, so we have that. We've got managed software that pops up out of nowhere to screw everything up. So we can give you that. We're going to send that right down to hell and then I'll put it in express package. Nah, nah. I, I was thinking something more along the lines of somebody who's just kind of staying staying there and is designated oh, for heaven. But we could bring them here. I mean, what about, uh, I don't know, just off the top of my head. What about Gavin McLeod? <laughs> oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Right now, you know, you know, make, no, 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 Captain Steubing, I don't want to be the reason Captain Steubing goes to hell. That was, that's, that, I, I, I couldn't enjoy purgatory if I knew those white socks, those, those immaculate shoes, I can't put him in hell, no. You know what, though, we could make a deal. We could put the whole love boat, the whole, in fact, the whole Sunday lineup, uh, we we could do uh, uh fantasy island we can send that we can send that one down to hell too it's also here it plays in purgatory all the time okay, okay. hey hey all right, hey, all right. All right. hey no no hey, hell hell can hell hell can i talk to you for a second sidebar sidebar with hell <laughs> listen what? listen 
Purgatory doesn't know that Love Boat and Fancy Island were on Saturday nights, not Sunday nights. I don't think that's the real Purgatory. What? Oh, we know. I just got my training with the Russians in the time zone thing. <laughs> no, Purgatory, <laughs> Purgatory doesn't know that's not real Purgatory. You just made a deal with somebody else. Is there a fourth level? This is not a video game. This is hell. <sighs> Can I play video games? Man in Software, <laughs> Software Center, Brian. What? What? You're going to get inside of the Man in Software Center, and we're going right back to hell. <laughs> and that's our show. And that's our show. Let's get out of here, Millie. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Jammers, for jamming. That was super fun. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, uh, yeah, God, oh, you can't put Captain Steubing in, in hell, no. Fantastic, I love it, love it. <laughs> and come on, Michelle, those shows were Saturday. You and I are close enough in age, you should know that. You I seriously thought that. I said Saturday and I said Sunday. It was just, it was just a type of thing. <laughs> uh, that was the thing, I know. I watched it yeah. with my grandmother every Sunday. Oh. When my parents had date night, we had Pepperidge Farms store-bought, Chocolate chip cookies. <laughs> and nice nice callback. Nice callback to store bought <laughs> nice cookies. Callback. Nice. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, Jammers, thank you so much.